We just completed the first day of our intensive Earth Wisdom and the Primordial Mind. And you can see we have as a visitor today uh, Mother Earth, sometimes known as Gaia, as well as two students, Mark and Sheila. We've been probing the question today, what is Earth Wisdom? And what is the Primordial Mind? And we have had considerable disagreement about that and much lively discussion. So along the way, we have, we have uh, spoken about the primordial mind being that interlinking intelligence that first showed itself a millisecond after the Big Bang. It's also the kind of intelligence that directs a skylark to a specific surrounding area in a very precise hand-to-glove fashion. And it's the same intelligence that allows us as humans to call upon the untamed part of ourselves that, through which we can access a deeper wisdom and a deeper intelligence. So I'm wondering if Mother Gaia has anything to say. I have a lot to say. It's been a wonderful day, and I think we've dealt with some very severe disturbances in the eco-field, but from the feminine perspective. So when I think about the bad news on the earth, I come from a place of grief and sadness. I'm not angry, but I am sad. But I'm also searching for balance, always searching for balance. And my purpose for existence is life. And I would like there to continue to be human life on this planet, but I want all life to have an equal chance. And Sheila, besides holding on the hat, <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what has been your response to the day? I have really appreciated the balance that I felt today. The balance between being outside and connecting with the different eco fields here on the ranch and then the uh, rigorous discussion about the content of the book, The Voices of the First Day, and the excitement of our agreeing and disagreeing about the content. It was, it, it was stimulating. And Mark? Well, for, for me, I, I found it, this is my very first day uh, at Wisdom University. So what I really appreciated was the, the quality of openness and honesty to disagree with each other, to agree, to support each other. Um, and that combination of, of um, intellectual uh, rigor and heartfelt openness to new ideas. And I think that's probably the answer for um, what lies ahead for all of us.